Lesson 3. The Emphatic Verb Form In the previous lesson, you learned to distinguish two forms of compound verbs, the progressive and perfect forms. Another compound verb form is the emphatic verb form. The word emphatic denotes emphasis, especially in the face of perceived disbelief or opposition on the part of the reader or listener. For example, the sentence, I do sing, implies that although the listener may not believe it, the speaker does, in fact, sing. As another example, compare these two sentences. The first sentence is simply an assertion that provides information about the subject, Jeff. In the second sentence, however, the use of the emphatic verb form strengthens this assertion, implying that the listener, you, believes that Jeff doesn't know this information. As with all compound verb forms, the emphatic form has a main verb, which tells the action of the sentence, plus an auxiliary verb that helps the main verb to function. For example, in this sentence, the main verb, write, denotes the type of action that the subject, my father, takes. The auxiliary verb, does, helps this verb to function as an emphatic verb, contradicting any potential belief to the contrary. Additionally, as with the other verb forms you've worked with, the emphatic verb form also includes a past form. For example, in this sentence, the verb did finish provides emphasis that the subject, we, performed the stated action. Here, this emphasis is reinforced with the exclamation point, which changes this sentence from a statement to an exclamation.